today we are discuss about most mp3 questions for arithmetic progression the production of tv set in a factory increases or decreases uniformly means common difference so finally answer is 5 to the 10 is 11000 only hello dear students how are you all i hope you all are doing well in your maths preparation today we are discuss about most mp3 questions for arithmetic progression in case study based type question this is easy to solve after coordinate geometry second most important chapter for case study based question for basic and standard students this epi so now let's begin our first question over here india is a competitive manufacturing location okay how to identify this question from the apis okay to the low cost manpower strong technical and engineering capabilities contributing to the higher quality production run the production of tv set in a factory increases or decreases uniformly means common difference it's like a common difference okay the production of tv sets and um, fix the number every year the produce 16000 set in the 6th year it means it gives about 6th year a6 is equals to 16000 okay we can directly conclude a plus 5d is equals to 16000 give this as a equation number 1 now for 22600 in the 9th year it means a9 is equals to 22600 a plus 8d is equals to 22600 gives as a equation number 2 now with the help of elimination method do the minus 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 so you will get minus 6600 is equals to minus 3d minus minus plus so you will directly get d common difference equal 2200 put this d either in equation 1 or 2 so you will get your first term uh, over here see So a plus five into two thousand two hundred into sixteen thousand. So finally, answer is five to the ten is eleven thousand only. Okay. So your first term, your first year production of TV sets for particular company is five thousand. It's a five thousand. Now you having a and d. What you have to find in which year production should be? You have to find n. You have to find n. So a n is given. An is given twenty nine thousand two hundred. So put this value. An is equals to a plus n minus one into d is equals to twenty nine thousand two hundred is equals to five thousand plus n minus one into common decimal two thousand two hundred. Now do the minus. So you will get over here twenty four thousand two hundred divide with this twenty two hundred is equals to n minus one. So two zero two zero. Twenty-two ones are twenty-two. Twenty-two ones are twenty-two. So your n minus one is equals to eleven. So at twelfth year, your TV sets production should be twenty-nine thousand two hundred. Now you have to find the production of the eighth year. It means you have to find a eight. A eight is equals to a plus seven d. A is equals to five thousand plus seven into d two thousand two hundred. So multiply fourteen double zero as it is uh, one and here. One five seven two is a fourteen plus one, fifteen thousand four hundred plus five, five thousand. So final answer for this is twenty thousand and four hundred TV sets on eighth year. Now next part, you have to answer. This is the TV sets production two peoples. Find the production in the first three years. For first year is the five thousand. Add this uh, two thousand two hundred common difference. First year is a five thousand only, okay. It's a seven thousand two hundred, and for the next uh, coming year, seven thousand four hundred. Find the difference of production in A seven minus A four. So you can directly put A plus six D minus A plus three D. Simplify this. So A plus six D minus A minus three D. So your answer should be three D. And in earlier, we already find. Your three D, three D equals to six thousand six hundred only. Okay, so six thousand six hundred. That's the difference of seventh year and fourth year. No need to find a seven and a fourth if you having already find find in earlier. Oh no, okay. Now next question. Most M P. Sheila, Sheila, visited store near a house and found the glass jars are arranged in one above another. Okay, on the top layer three jars. Okay. Fine. Next layer six jars. Up to next nine. Okay. 
on till eighth layer. Okay, it means A8. Okay, fine. On the basis of above situation, answer the right and AP whose terms represent the number of jars in different starting from top. Also find the common difference. So now common difference A2 minus A1 is equals to 3 and this like 6, 9 and last term is 24 because uh, total 8th layers are there. Is it possible to arrange 34 jars in this layer for the pattern? Okay, now instead of a n, you should put 34 a plus n minus 1 into d. If you are getting your n in the form of natural number, so you your answer is yes. So, a instead of a is a 3, n minus 1, common difference is also 3 and here 34. Plus do the minus 31 n minus 1 into 3. Now, divide n minus 1 is equals to 31 by 3. No, sir, no, we cannot arrange 34 jars in continued pattern okay so either 33 or 36 may arrange because the multiple of 3 only okay now the next question if there is a n number of rows okay in a layer then find the expression for the total number of jars in the terms of n okay it's a 3 6 9 up to up to n okay and then find out s8 okay no problem so, total number of jar means Sn you have to find. So, it's a n by 2, 2a plus n minus 1 into common difference d. So, n as it is 2a, it means 3, n minus 1 as it is common difference is 3. So, now you should simplify this. So, n by 2, 2 3s are 6 plus 3n minus 3. So, your answer should be n by 2, uh, 3 plus 3n. So, take 3 as a common. So, 3 by 2 and in bracket n plus 1. Now, expression in the terms of n. So, now with the help of this, this is your Sn. This is your Sn. Now, instead of n, put this 8. So, 3 by 2 into 8. 8 plus 1. So, 2 4s are 4 3s are 12. 12 into 9. So, total 1 0 8 jars. Okay. Now, now next question number b the shopkeeper added three jars in each layer so now six nine and twelve okay how many jars are there in fifth layer from the top so now your a is changed a is six a is equals to six common difference as it is a5 is equals to a plus n minus one into d so now instead of three you have to put six plus four d so, 6 plus common difference D is only 3. So, 4 into 3, 12 plus 6, it's 18. Okay. In fifth layer, uh, how many? Okay. So, how many jars are there in fifth layer from the top? Oh, total, total. It means S5 we have to answer. This is for fifth. Okay, no problem. So, from the top, S5 is equals to n by 2. 2a plus n minus. Okay, now you're having a first and last term, na? 18 jars and in first 6. So, directly you can put n by 2, a plus a 5. So, 5 by 2, a is 6 and uh, at the fifth, it's a 18. So, it's a 5 by 2 into 24. So, 12 fives are 60 jars. Okay, you can directly also match your answer with n by 2, 2a, n minus 1 into d. So also you will getting the same answer 12 plus 12 24 also 60 is your answer okay now the last question for you three numbers in ap have the sum 30 what is the middle term i already explained this question in earlier now you have to write down your answer do it your by self in comment section what will be your answer okay fine thank you so much dear I hope you will getting this whole section very well. Hope we will meet for the next amazing session next time. Thank you.